。这个星期是美国的宪法周，光是在这个星期内，全美就有两万七千位移民宣誓成为美国公民。今天就有八十位小朋友和青少年在洛杉矶宣誓入籍，成为美国公民，展开新的人生历程，其中也包括华人移民。八十名来自不同国家的小朋友及青少年，今天在洛杉矶市中心的中央图书馆宣誓成为美国公民。Well, at school, I could like tell my friends that I am an American citizen now, and they're all like they were born here, so I'm the only one, and that would make me happy because I could I would fit in with them. These citizens are from Canada, Taiwan, Mexico, Salvador, Belarus, and others. Parents who attended the ceremony of admission also felt very happy. Very happy for our children to have their first experience of university and all aspects of their future. They have made a lot of progress in their education. 本周将有两万七千位移民宣誓成为美国公民，他们当中有不少人出来美国谋生的过程十分艰辛。不过，他们的子女因为父母的努力付出，从今天起享有美国公民的一切权利和义务。I mean, they can go to school where they want to. They can pick any job profession they want. They can live anywhere in the United States that they want to live. You know, so they can choose anything like that. Responsibilities come in the in the form of let's be a good citizen. Let's take advantage of our right to vote. Let's make sure that we're out there to make our communities a better place. 联邦公民及移民服务局洛杉矶县办事主任南希·艾菲说，她从这些孩子的眼中看到了美国的未来与希望。I mean, we're all immigrants. We came from somewhere, whether it was a generation ago or two or three generations. But these individuals just add so much to our society, the diversity, the culture. It's what makes us what we are today. 也许对这些三到十七岁的孩子们来说，昨天与今日没有什么不同。但在不远的将来，更好的教育与工作机会将向他们敞开大门。洛杉矶十八台记者陈晨、孙梦一采访报道。